ever wondered how to make the perfect shakshuka? Well, today is your lucky day as we dive into the world of culinary delights and take on this Middle Eastern classic. Shakshuka, for the uninitiated, is a dish of eggs poached in a spicy tomato and pepper sauce. It's a breakfast favorite that can easily transition into lunch or dinner. We begin our journey with two tablespoons of olive oil. Heat it up in a large skillet or frying pan over medium heat. Add a large onion, thinly sliced, and a sliced red bell pepper. Saute these until they start to soften. It usually takes about five to seven minutes. Next, we add three minced garlic cloves and a blend of spices, one teaspoon each of ground cumin and paprika, and a quarter teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Cook this aromatic concoction for another one to two minutes until the air is filled with their tantalizing scent. Now comes the heart of the dish, one 28 ounce can of whole peeled tomatoes. Crush these by hand or chop them up, then pour them into the pan. Season with salt and pepper and stir to combine all the ingredients. Allow this tomato mixture to simmer for about 10 to 15 minutes or until it thickens slightly. Stir occasionally to prevent sticking. Taste and adjust the seasoning as needed. The stage is set for the stars of our show, five to six large eggs. Make small wells in the sauce using the back of a spoon and crack an egg into each well. Season the eggs with a little salt and pepper and then cover the skillet with a lid. Cook over low heat for about five to 10 minutes or until the eggs are just set but the yolks are still runny. Adjust the cooking time if you prefer your eggs more or less done. To finish off, remove the skillet from the heat and sprinkle the shakshuka with chopped cilantro or parsley and crumbled feta cheese if you fancy. Serve it hot right from the skillet with warm crusty bread or pita for dipping into the sauce and egg yolks. Remember, shakshuka can be made as mild or as spicy as you like. Adjust the amount of cayenne pepper to suit your taste or add chili flakes for extra heat. And if you don't have canned tomatoes, use fresh ripe ones. You'll need about four cups of chopped tomatoes. So there you have it, shakshuka, a simple yet flavorful dish that's sure to impress. Whether in the morning, afternoon, or evening, this versatile dish is a delight to the palate. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to help Magnolia Moon reach 1,000 subscribers. Until next time, happy cooking!